<laughs> we know it. Today is the day we go get our real this year. Ah, get joker. Hey, what are these things you are talking about? Why it a whole year can't keep doing it? Etta shit and halup. Etta shit and halup. I had a pain and made when someone else has removed minerals from the ground. Hey, this ground, ha, my friend, this ground we sit on is very rich. My friend, we have to be compensated. <laughs> Who pays these royalties? Tito, where have you been? Aha, uh -huh. you're the man I was just looking for. Now listen, royalties are paid by a person who takes minerals from the ground we own. And to do that, these people also must have a caritaving like a chamak in it, a lemon minimum in Kakwa. something like a ticket in a matter of Eh, exactly. Who do they pay these royalties to then? to the Commissioner for Geological Survey and Mines Department under the Ministry of Energy and Mineral Development. Now listen, this is the most interesting part. These royalties are received by Apukana, Uganda, a local government care district, Angole Elemere, Ninyomen, Kaakwap, Kae Lope, Angalup, Anini Ale Maritere, Ninyomen, Tara Angalup, New York. What is our benefit then? Look at it this way. Kenda ngangita shi se ulunga lipionga tomon. Anguni oli pa anguna lipionga tomon nguna ijario. Elodete ngali pionga nka uni na puka ni na apolon. Ali puta ngami anka nka re elodete na puka na local government. E hadi na idingi lope e kanga lup tora ina yu one ngami anga uni. Ewa, let us go and get our share then. Ah ah, not so fast, dear friend. Ejaka it, ejaka it. To receive royalties. E maiki na ewa nuri amutu akarita danga lup alo ministry. Angola e polo kini tanga lup. Uh, now, Chief, please tell us more about this land title. Oh, thank you. And now listen carefully. In the case of customary land, the land title is called a Certificate of Customary Ownership. To get this certificate, first we have to, one, form a group in our community to manage the land. Register this group as a communal land association with the district registrar of titles in our district. Pick the application form from your district land office and pay a fee of Uganda shillings 5,000. The communal land association must then apply for a certificate of customary land ownership by submitting an application form to their sub-county chief. And in this case, that's me. The area land committee will then notify the public of the intended registration of the land, draw a sketch map and forward the application to the district land board for approval. Upon approval and payment of Uganda shillings 5,000, a certificate of customary ownership with a customary land identification number will be awarded by the sub-county chief, who is the recorder. With this certificate of customary ownership in hand and a registered bank account, an association is then eligible to receive the 3% royalty payment as the legal owner or occupier of the land where minerals are taken. Hey, now our part is done. We can go receive our loyalties from the government. <laughs>